All right, all right, we in the building and everything. Me and my dog, Mr. Lucario, the bad boy. Here we go. Hey. Yeah, man, this is being brought to you by, come on, guys, let's get it. Game Kings, all right? Come on, Definition of Man Part 2, man, with Mr. Lucario, Miles Cunningham, Taekwondo, Juan Rills, and Kerry K. Zagan. Uh, uh, do you want to say anything about this, uh, Lucario, before we get into the yeah, show? Yeah. So guys, remember, uh, get your tickets now ASAP because it's happening in like a week and a half. So make sure you guys go get that. Uh, you know, hit me up, hit Miles up uh, in the DMs. Check any under any of the latest videos. The ticket link is there, so make sure uh, you guys go get that shit cracking. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and also, guys, it, it will be online as well, right? Right, Lacar, yeah. it will be online as well. So if you're not in New York, you can also uh, check it online, get the online tickets, and then you guys can also, you know, check it out online. So, yeah, so definitely make sure you go do that. You know what I'm saying? All right, that's good. Guys, I got a question. Go ahead and put a cue in the chat. We got y'all covered today. We're talking about why game is easy for some and hard for others. Uh, Lucario, mm -hmm. you know, we've we've been doing this for a long, long time. And uh and I, I got some I got some stuff that I want to throw to you first that you know people think just you can't buy your way into the game. You gotta mm -hmm. learn really how to have structure, understanding. And I think one thing a lot of these guys don't have is that they they look at everything through their lens. Versus right. the lens of somebody else, as in, um, uh, you know, people think just because they got degrees or they can go to school and stuff mm -hmm. like that, that they are capable of learning street game. You know, hustlers, pimps, max ballers, players, gigolos, mm -hmm. you know, men that right. have game that are not, not, not in the book smart world, but the street smart. But what say you, my brother? Yeah, I think what, what happens is, is that the reason why is, you know, hard for some dudes to learn game or understand game is because most most guys never actually sit down and listen to people who do have game to have an understanding of it in the first place so they, they already think they know everything they already think they know what it is so they're like oh i don't you know i don't need this i know this or whatever i don't need none of this like we had a dude that called up the other day we was telling him like yo you need to get on the membership you need to get some coach or whatever and he was like oh yeah well i don't really need all that but i'm like but you call it in though so if you're calling in, then obviously you you need some game, right? right. So the, the the problem is is that guys are too proud to yeah. to to yeah. sit back and and understand certain things. Because even even you know with us, we we're constantly learning every day. We're not sitting there oh, like, yeah. oh, shit, you know, I know everything. So let me, yeah. you know, what I'm saying. So yeah. so a lot of dudes don't get this. So this is why they never get to that point where they're actually improving or making things happen because they're already in their ego and they think they already know everything. And so when you think you know everything, right, what happens is, is that you don't leave any room for you to learn and therefore you stay in the same space. And a right. lot of times they just, you know, they're just so caught up in the ego. Well, and it is a prime example of ego and foolishness. Uh, again, you can always tell a motherfucker that's terrible with women. <laughs> because, because, because the, first, the, first thing, the first thing they come in their mind is that, they say silly, stupid ass shit like this, and they're the ones that's struggling with women and shit. Mm -hmm. And here's the thing, and it's the, it's the, here's the here's the problem that people don't understand. Lucario and I have been given free game mm -hmm. for decades, exactly. and still you motherfuckers can't even do the free shit that mm -hmm. y'all are being told what to do. So. Game has nothing to do with money. It's not the fact that game is worthless. It's the fact, Kev, that you're worthless. You're mm -hmm. worthless to your father who probably isn't around. You're worthless to your single fucking ass mother who has taught you how to be very effeminate and emotional. This is crazy. What kind of bitch ass shit is this, Lucario? Jesus you know, Christ. You know, it's funny with his, his, with his statement. He said, he said, I'm hearing game is worthless if you don't have money so he don't even he don't even believe what the fuck he's saying he just said oh i i basically heard this and so he's not living a life where he's experiencing things so he's just talking about what the fuck he heard from somebody else who is probably another guy who's a loser who heard it from some other loser you feel right what I'm right in 3k no this this is not for you because this is what see this is where the the, the minds go wrong mm. most of you guys or the majority of you guys come from the school of books right you don't come from street game so 
to even ask the question is showing that you're not even worthy to become a student because how do you, why would you ask, is learning game easy or even a possibility? It's not a possibility for you because you do not want to dedicate yourself to yourself. You don't give a fuck about yourself. You see yourself as a loser. You've got a fixed mindset. You've got a feminine type mentality. So no, the game isn't easy or possible for you because listen to your statement that you're saying. Lakara, what would you say to this loser right here? He says learning game easily even a possibility. See, this is the thing. Uh, see, y'all make shit more complicated than it needs to be, right? You ever hear the say when they say it, it's, it's so simple, it's complicated, right? Yes. The, the reason why it, it becomes complicated to most guys, right, is because they're making it complicated by one, like I said earlier, thinking you know what it is when you don't. You feel what I'm saying? Right. And I, and that's the thing where if you see if you the, the complication comes in right when you're getting in your own way the complication comes in when you're actually not applying the game and actually getting a mentor the complication comes in like for example you know why it's so complicated for people to lose weight and get fit is because they think they know how to do it even though they don't right. so they, they do shit they don't lose weight. They probably gain more weight, right? And they're like, what the fuck? This is so hard. No, it's not hard. It's not complicated. You just don't know what to do. And because you think you know what to do, you don't actually go see, seek help because your ego won't allow you to seek help. And then so once you seek help and once a person who is like a personal trainer, someone who's a, a fitness expert or knows these things, and they put you onto some game when it comes to fitness, then you'll learn, oh, I was doing this wrong the whole time. Oh, I didn't even know about this. Oh, I didn't even realize that. And then if you apply what you didn't know that you know now, then you'll realize how simple it can be. But if you're in your own way, this is why you're not going to get anywhere. Right. And this is why you don't get anywhere because he has his ears on the YouTube street. He see, it's easy to listen to somebody giving you theory. It's easy to listen to somebody complaining. But one thing you will know about real motherfuckers that have game, they will never bitch, whine, moan, and complain or make excuses. And regardless if Acario knows you or not, you don't keep your ear on game. You keep your ear on the YouTube streets, Lucario. But you got it, sir, Lucario. Wait, is this is this the Kev that I know? Is this, I think I, I think I know what this is. But Kev, Kev he, he knows what's going on. He playing games. Stop playing games, Kev. You know what's popping off, bro. Stop playing. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh yeah, man. I man. I man. I punch that motherfucker in his face, wasting my time with that bitch ass <laughs> shit. Anyway, guys, I want to call it eight three three eight five nine eight seven four four. It's number eight uh five eight three three eight five nine eight seven four four. See, the thing is, is that most of these guys, their their attitudes, they come in. Most of these guys come in with a loser attitude. Mm -hmm. Most of my, no, even hey, let's no, wait, back it up. Not even let's go even before loser attitude. Mm -hmm. Most of these guys worship women as God. Right. They 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 think and are scared. Let let's let's keep it a buck. They are terrified and scared of women. They mm -hmm. know they are. They 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 can be in denial all they want, but they are scared of women. Lucario, what say you, my brother? Oh well, yeah, that, uh, listen, man, it's it's funny because most of these guys, unfortunately, they never even get into a a, a situation where they've had women who actually want to be with them, women who are trying to get at them women who are crying because they can't see, you know, they, they're not able to see you that day. They, don't, they never get women who buy them gifts, get women who do any of these things that show they have desire. And the reason why is because, you know, these guys who are scared of women, right. They never actually do anything in order to be in these type of situations. Cause they're not the man that these women, these, these type of women want in the first place. They, they're not they're These guys, see guys, you got to understand something. If you're not an attractive motherfucker, right? And when I say attractive, I'm not talking about your, just your looks because I know how simple niggas be thinking, right? If you're not an attractive guy, that means you can't attract, right? And being scared of women means you are unattractive, which means you're not going to attract, which means you're not going to experience the type of things that guys who do have game experience. You see what I'm saying? And so this is why for, for some of you guys, it's hard out here because 
you don't even realize that you're not attractive. See, it's one thing to not be attractive, but you know what's worse than be, not being attractive? What's worse than not being attractive is realizing you're not attractive. Or is not realizing you're not attractive, meaning that you don't even realize that you're not attractive. So that you can't you can't even do nothing about it because you don't even realize it. And then this yeah. is why you start blaming women. You're like, oh, these bitches out here, these women be acting this way. No, they're acting that way towards you because you're not attractive. Right. <laughs> so, right. It's not even attractive to the world. Okay. Why would a woman be attracted to a man that doesn't feel attractive to himself? Right. Why exactly. Would a woman want to follow a man who can't even lead himself. Why would right. a woman why would a woman want to love a man who doesn't even love himself? Why would a woman want to be with somebody who doesn't believe in itself? So right. if y'all think about it, in Lucario, I uh I uh I did a show uh yesterday talking about how women control men because <laughs> men teach women how to be how to use and be manipulated by men. Right. Mm -hmm. and, and most guys out there, you can't you can't get what you don't feel. And if you don't believe in yourself, why should a woman believe in you? Why should she want to sleep with you? When she can be with a real man that actually believes in who he is. Lucario, what say you, my brother? Exactly. Because the thing is, she has a choice. So why would she choose you if you're being on some loser shit when she could get with a dude who's a winner? <laughs> is that simple? Uh, right. Question, does game and street smarts go hand in hand? Yes, but it's a weird way how it works. It's weird how it works. Having book smarts is good, and but book smarts doesn't work on the street. Mm -hmm. But when you have street smarts, it works everywhere. See, most of you guys, I've always said, Lucario, most people don't understand when you have street smarts or you have game, you, when you, even like in it, like I was saying, I give an example, like a job interview, Lucario, mm -hmm. see a book smart person will look at the job and try to sell himself on the job. Mm -hmm. A person that has game realizes the, there, he doesn't look at the job. He looks at the person who chooses, who picks the person to have the job. So exactly. he goes after the the interviewer. He doesn't give a fuck about the uh, the job itself because mm -hmm. he knows out of everybody who has book smarts, they're going to try to sell a resume. They're going to mm -hmm. try to sell how long they've been working and all that other stuff. Where right. people don't understand is when you have game, you talk to the source that chooses who is going to work at that job. So mm -hmm. game, when you have game, game flows into everything. But when you have book smarts, it flows only to book smarts. That's it. Lucario would say you, brother. Right. That's that's some real shit. And, and that's that's the thing where people don't understand how deep it goes, because even, for example, like in business, you know, a lot of times people buy from business people or, uh, uh, you know, a person because they like that person or they have some sort of like attraction or attachment to that particular person, not necessarily the, what they're selling, but because of that, but just why did the Jordan sell so well, because people loved Michael Jordan. So they're like, I want to get the Jordans because that, that dude is the shit and everybody else is saying it's the shit. So now I want to be a part of that whole situation. Right. It, like right. if in reality, it's just a sneaker. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like any other thing. It's not, it's not like anything that special. That's, you know, like, Oh my God, this is like some magical shit, but, it's because it's attached to that that brand and that that person and 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 the vibe that goes along with that whole situation. So so men with game, what they understand is is that they understand how that operates. So when you're talking to women, when you're doing business, or you know just when you're dealing with people in general, right? You have you you have a a different understanding of how to navigate so that you can create certain situations. The problem is like you were saying, when you have those book smarts, what you do is, is that a lot of guys that have book smarts, they negate like actual street smarts because they negate the actual like, um, you know, energy and vibe that goes along in a situation. There, 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 you know, like, this is why, if you notice, if you do your, your research back in the day when like the whole pickup artist shit was like popping off back in the, you know, early 2000s or whatever, Pickup artists were generally nerds who were who had a lot of book smarts trying to figure out formulas to get women. Yes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ooh, yes. So that's, so that's why they were always like, oh, well, you have to, you know, do this first. And then this, and then after that, you do this, and then you neg her. And then after that, you make sure you do it. And it's like all this technical, technical shit, because they were coming from a book smart kind of thought process. And what happened is, is that because they didn't have any actual social skills 
out in the streets. They didn't actually have any social skills to interact with people. That was the, that was sort of a gateway to get from point A to point B. You feel what I'm saying? But what happened is, is that the reason why I was so tough for a lot of the pickup artists or the guys that were trying to do all these things was because when they actually got out there in the real world and was actually talking to women, right? They would talk to women like they were t- trying to talk to robots or figure out some code. Yes, and the women yes. looking at them like, what the hell's wrong with this motherfucker? You know what I'm saying? He, ain't got no, he don't understand what's going on. It's crazy. Right. And the thing is, is that what would help with the problem is with a lot of you guys that read books, like I always say, you read books to learn how to drive a car versus mm-hmm. put 10 toes down and, and drive the car. A book mm-hmm. cannot teach you vision. It can't teach you communication. It can't teach you courage. It can't mm-hmm. teach you adaptability. It can't teach you accountability. It can't teach you integrity. It can't teach you certain things that when you get with somebody, see, like I said, even with the job, let's look at women for a second. A book can't teach you how to be innovative. The mm-hmm. thing is, most of you guys, y'all look at the pussy. Y'all look at her body. You look at her ass. You look at her titties. Where a motherfucker that has game is looking at himself. He ain't mm-hmm. even looking at the motherfucking woman. He know and listen, the woman has no part in the game, and that's what they understand. You right. make when you have book smarts, you make everything about the game. That's why when you go on YouTube and you hear book smart people give you theory mm-hmm. about women, because at the core of everything they're trying to communicate to other people that are book smart is that they make everything about the woman. People Mm -hmm. that have game make it about the man. So the man that makes it about himself is only showing a woman to have opportunity to be with him, not being an option, Lucario. Guys, lines are open if y'all got a question, but Lucario, what say you, my brother? Yeah, guys, call in 833-859-8744. So, you know, it's funny. I was looking the other day. They had this, um, I don't know if you heard about this thing. Was it? Uh, it's called chat GTP or G- chat something, whatever, the, the AI, the uh, artificial intelligence bullshit. So basically, guys are sort of trying to use that to talk to women and shit, like to text uh, women, all right? So so I was watching this video where, you know, dude would be talking to the chick on, on, a, on a dating app or, or texting a girl. And then he'll go into the to the the chat joint, and then the the, the oh. artificial intelligence, and then give her response so that the, the artificial intelligence could give him a response or whatever to send to her, right? So dude's thinking that this is some type of cheat code, yeah, chat, uh, chat, uh, G- 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 PT, G- right? Yeah. So I'm like, bro, yeah, that's cool and all, but what's gonna happen when you meet the girl in person? There you go. Yes. You see yes. What I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what's gonna happen when you meet the girl in person? You can't use that artificial intelligence in person. Right. So she's going to realize that you ain't that dude who was texting. That was the artificial intelligence. That wasn't you. And so that's yeah. the that's the part that guys don't understand where. And, and this is what makes it so hard. And shout out to my dude, Platinum Elite in the chat. This yeah, is yeah, what I wanted, yeah. Hard. Platinum, what's up, Platinum? Yes, sir. That's what that's what makes it so hard for a lot of guys in the game is that they they're trying all these little book smarty type of. Let me, uh, you know, find shortcuts. Let me, you know, figure out the algorithm of the woman type of vibe. And I'm like, bro, that doesn't, that does not work. It does not work because part, see, part of what, part of what makes a woman attracted to you, she has to feel you. Do you understand? This is, this is why when we say slang, when we say someone is, are you feeling that person? I'm feeling this girl. She's feeling me. Or, you know, the girl is like, I'm feeling that guy. There has to be that feeling. So feeling doesn't come from, you know, uh, uh, s- algorithms and all that other stupid shit and, and formulas. It don't come from that. The feeling comes from the actual energy that you emanate from your masculinity, from who you are as a man, right? That's the that's the way the feeling comes from. So the woman has to feel you. So a lot of times, this is why we say, you know, you hear this saying the game is in you, not on you, right? So right. You can't just say shit that me and Steve is saying. So we could we could tell you something we'll say to a woman, but you'll say it and she'll look at you like you fucking crazy because you, it's not coming from you. It's not coming from a place of authenticity. So you're just you're just saying you're just saying words. And this is why you, you never really connect with the chick. All right, we got a call real quick. Let's bring in 201. We got a few questions to answer as well. Uh area code uh 201 sir, how can we help you sir? What's up? Yeah, yeah. I I just wanted to make a little comment on that that Chat GPT man. It, you guys, you you can't be serious trying to talk 
ask a robot a <laughs> human question. And then on top of that, you asking it that. Why aren't you asking it how to make a business? What? The game is all fucked up, man. <laughs> no, the game is not fucked up. That's that's a lie. The game is not fucked up. You're fucked up by saying that comment. You don't have any game to say that comment. That's People who have game don't say the game is fucked up because you're the fucking game, which means you're saying the game is fucked up. So you're saying I'm fucked up. The game ain't fucked mm. up. You're fucked up, sir. Mm. So what's your question, man? <laughs> Man, I just wanted to just say, man, shout out to y'all. Good game, man. I'm listening in. And listen, man, I ain't got no question. Y'all always speaking the truth. And if I do ask you a question, I already know the answer. Oh, I'm sorry. Thank you, sir. We appreciate it. Thank you for the call, brother. We appreciate it. All right. So let's keep going to somebody. All right. This guy asked this question. He says, it's safe to say the academic types uh, are going to approach a lot of the bad boy mythology and overthinking simple stuff and end up with uh, analysis paralysis, basically uh, scaring. See, this is what, guys. You, you get the fuck out of your book thinking all you're going to learn is how to open a door and turn on a light switch in a different way this is, game is not complicated the only thing that is complicated is getting you guys to get unlearn mm -hmm. the cult mentality most of you guys, all that red pill shit that y'all look at, all that hypergamy and, and pills and plates and saucers and uh, lay counts and all that other stuff, the, th the thing that you're going to understand is first you've got to learn how to unlearn all the stupid shit that you have learned on the internet that was theory. There are levels to this. So don't you're, you're overcomplicating this. What you need to do is stop trying to figure it out and get with one of us and start becoming a student so you can understand because the shit you're saying is too deep to even break down even in this show. Lucario, what say you, brother? Yeah, and, I, and, and that's the thing uh, with, with this right here is that, see, this is what happens when guys come to the to the game thinking they know shit already. So, so, so the thing is, the reason why they start overthinking and all of that is because they they're they're going back or reverting back to yeah. bullshit that they were thinking in the first place. So it's like, see, in order to in order to step your game up, you got to come to this shit with an open mind. You got to come with an empty cup. You understand? Y'all be coming yeah. with cups. Empty your cup out. All empty all that. See, and 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 unfortunately, a lot of the shit that that you guys consume on the internet makes it worse. So you start you start uh, hearing all this shit about oh women and body counts and pair bonding and hypergamy and you know uh, uh, the, the 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 gynocentric whatever and they're gonna take you to the court and all all these things you keep hearing that's that's poisoning your mind. So when it comes to you actually trying to make something happen when you're dealing with women, you can't even do it because. The, you're you're fucking uh you know so caught up in all this bullshit like yo i remember i went out with this chick once to get drinks right yes sir and this chick said to me <laughs> like it was the funniest shit so she said to me she was like yo she was like hey uh do, did you ever hear about this guy called kevin samuels so i just start busting out laughing and shit right yeah. so <laughs> so, she's like, so she told me she went out on a date with some dude and he was quoting Kevin Samuel shit, like on the date. Like, so this is this is the type of goofy shit that that these guys will do. You understand? Like they're they'll hear shit on the internet and literally talk about the shit they heard on the internet while they're out with a woman. You understand? Like, this is how goofy niggas is gotten. So you gotta understand, you gotta get rid of all of that nonsense out of your head so that you can you can actually like be a fucking human being. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Right. Question here. Uh, how can you integrate book smarts in the game? See, again, you don't listen. This ain't for you. So, yeah, I, I don't understand. Y'all motherfuckers don't understand. You cannot integrate book smarts into something you don't know and something you don't understand. You've got to learn under somebody to get understanding to learn game. See, you guys think game is maybe a board game or some silly ass thing that you, a sport you watch on TV. See, that's, see this is what y'all trying to do. You're trying to learn how to be a doctor in a day versus dedicate yourself to dedicating yourself to yourself. Lakari, what do you want to say before I show you the next stupid ass 
comment under this? What, what do you want to say under this? About this? This is the thing. You, you, you don't integrate book smarts into your game. That's that that's that's what makes your game weak is integrating all well, because because the thing is, all that statistics and all that other shit y'all be talking about, that's all the book smarts. And and when you integrate that into your situation, into your game, that's when you fuck shit up. Because then that's when you start overthinking. That's when you get out the fucking moment. That's when you're you're all over the place. You understand? So the thing is, is that you got to understand that a lot of, see, the whole book smarts thing is like Steve was saying, is theory for guys to try to understand real shit. But when you, when you understand real shit, you, the theory don't make, uh, it, it, it's meaningless because you don't need theory when you understand real shit. Like, I don't have to have a theory that, you know, I'm dark skinned. You understand? I don't, I don't have to have a theory that I just took a shit earlier. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, like it happened. I know it happened. And I was there. You understand what I'm saying? Like, yeah, right, right, I was right. When I took a shit, right? So I don't need, well, statistically, you know, when people sit out on a toilet, uh, <laughs> what are you talking about? You see what I'm saying? Like, that's what people think. That's what people talk about when they're trying to explain real shit that they don't understand. That's really all it is. Okay, well, allow me to go ahead and cut the, go in and make you a nice sandwich and cut the sides of your bread. Let me cut you in and tell you the world is going to be perfect and nice and all this other stuff. You have got to be fucking kidding me. What do you mean give you a break sometime? Why don't you walk up to a goddamn woman and say this stupid ass shit? <laughs> do y'all understand everything is competition and it's not competition with the world. It's competition with yourself. These women don't have an unfair advantage on the dating market. They just realize a loser when they see one. What the fuck are you talking about? Can we give you a break? Fuck you. How about that for a break? Because well, guess what? Call up, man. <laughs> yeah, call up. Because if you don't see we're trying to help you, fuck you. Then this ain't for you. Then sit and go back to whatever theory you're about. Because a woman can see that you got a tight pussy saying some pussy shit like this, Lucario. So he says, he says these women have an unfair Jesus Christ the dating so what is what does that even mean like how is like what is unfair uh black john call up or, or put it in chat or something because i'm like what do you mean unfair what is what does that even mean oh you know what's unfair that guys like us get pussy and they right. have to sit back and eat our scraps it's unfair that women send us messages and say they think about us when they don't even talk to them it's unfair that we work hard and you sit on your lazy ass on YouTube all the time. Sure is unfair, ain't it? Well, fuck you. It is unfair. Sucks for you, bitch. I'm sorry. It is. Fuck you. It sucks for you. How about that, motherfucker? Let's get to the next call. Let me the next thing. Y'all call it. We got y'all. Right, here you go, Lucari. What are some examples of things uh, you get women to do for you outside of cooking and cleaning? I know part of it. Well, it, it, okay, sir. Every woman, every woman is different, but it's not about stop making it about examples to get women to do for you. What the fuck, AG, AJ, are you going to do for yourself? This mm -hmm. is not for learning purposes because what you're trying to do is you want us to sell us to you, and that's not game. You want us to keep giving you fucking examples to inspire you to do something that you actually don't want to do. So fuck no, I'm not going to give you any examples. The only example I would give you is get off your lazy fucking ass and learn some goddamn game and stop worrying about motherfucking women. How about that for an example? Lucario, well, what's in you, brother? Well, AJ, you got to understand, bro, is that, see, the, the question that you're asking, right? Or I should say the answer to the question that you're asking should 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 already be in your own mind because if you say what are some examples of things women do for you outside of cooking and cleaning right what do you want women to do for you like you're asking like you're asking us that's like me saying yo steve uh what's what's my favorite food to eat like why would steve why would i be asking steve what my favorite food is i should know what my favorite food is right so so you're asking us what should a woman do for you you should know what you want to do which you can put women to work to do for you yeah. so that so the question means you don't you might not understand what you want 
So if you knew what you want, then that would be the thing that women do for you outside of cooking and cleaning. So that means you don't have anything that you need women or want women to do or even know that you would want women to do outside cooking and cleaning. So you got to answer that for yourself. And then that will be your, your, your answer right there. You well, here's this, this is how you know he's full of shit because you're not a student of the... How, okay, I don't understand something. How can one talk about something that he's not a student of? Why would he, what do you mean, how do you start realizing? You can't start realizing anything because you don't fucking believe in yourself. You're scared of women. You don't have a standard. You don't know how to fuck. You ain't got a mouthpiece and you can't talk a woman out her panties. So let me ask you a question. You don't realize you have game because you don't have game. You never had game. The only game that you had, and I'll give you credit, is you got to the egg. That's the only game that you had. The only time in your life you were one thought, one mind, one way was when you got to the egg. After that shit, it went apart. You lost. You don't have game. So in order to get game, you've got to be under somebody who is game the fuck up so they can teach you, brother. Mm -hmm. Lucario would say you, man. Yeah, and I, I would say, uh, you know, it's it's funny again. A lot of the a lot of the questions, the answers in the question, right? It's like this, like you know, you're saying when do when, when does one start realizing they got game, right? So what happens is is that you you understand that you have it because you have it meaning i realize i have glasses on my face why because i can see that i have glasses on my face <laughs> you understand so I'm, i would never ask hey steve is, are there glasses on my face i don't have to ask that question because i can see it so the same thing happens in, in, when, it, when it comes to game you don't ask hey when do i know i have game if you have to ask you don't have it you see what i'm saying that's that's what we're talking about you see yeah. what i mean yeah, it, 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 you're, you're right, sugar. You're absolutely. It's a guys. This is a travesty. <laughs> this is sad, and, and you know it's so fucking sad. And I hate to agree with a woman, but God damn it, it's sad. It is sad. Either you have it or you don't. No, 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 no. You choose to have it or not, brother. That's what y'all don't understand. Mm -hmm. You choose not to be a student. You choose to sit on your ass. You choose to make excuses. You right. choose to worship women. You choose to go on YouTube and follow motherfuckers who are not gamed up, but they sit around and complain more than teach you shit. Lucario, what right. say you? Oh, wait, we got a call, but let, all right. All right, 617, sir. How can we help you, sir? What's up? Y'all doing, sir? Yes, so, sir. Uh, I, 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 I've been watching the show, right? And um, I agree with everything y'all are saying, man, because, like, I, I can put myself to that situation. Like, when I started me taking action, that's when I noticed the game started working for me. I, I know Stevie Bob said and all that. Sir, wait, time I out. Sir, it. sir, stop. Are, are you part of the man mindset of the bad boy membership? No, I'm, I'm not. So I'm then not. you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. What the fuck you mean you're applying... <laughs> Oh, come on, man. Wait, 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 hold on, wait, wait. I'm gonna let you talk. Wait, wait. I'm gonna let you talk. Wait, just listen, 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 listen. I love how your minds trick you to think that you actually something that you're not. If you are a loser and you have a thought, do you think you'll think like a winner? You think you think that you're gonna think like us when you don't even know what the fuck the game is about, but you think you have game? Are you serious? Yeah, but Steve, oh uh, shit. Steve, honestly, hold on, hold on, please. Let me, let me just say something. Real quick, Steve, let's be serious. Like, if you really want to get results out there, you have to go out there and take action. Every, I think gaming. All right, sir. Okay, sir. Wait, time out. Time out. Time out. Tell us the action you're taking. What is the action you're taking? So I'm going out there and I'm talking to women. Well, okay, stop. Okay, wait, wait. What are you saying to women? Like, for example, say if I'm in a club, you know, just fucking talk. I don't know. No, I don't know. Because let me tell you something, motherfucker. The, the communication is not you with a woman, dumbass. The communication is with yourself. So that's how we know you don't have game. Because all you're doing is communicate. Sir, I'm just taking what you said. You said you communicate with women. Then you ain't got no motherfucking game. Because the game ain't about you communicating with women. The game is how you communicate to yourself to women. See, with all due respect. Oh, with all due respect. Okay, I'm sorry. No, no, you, no, no, okay, no, with no, all no. due respect. Oh, no way. We don't know anything about game. Please tell us, tell us dumbasses no. what you <laughs> want to tell us. Go ahead. Tell us your winning oh, no. formula of how you get women. Listen. 
I mean, I'm, I'm sure Lakari can agree with what I'm about to say right now. Like, honestly, like, be, let's be honest. You have to take action. I, th I think game is different for everybody. Like, like the way you describe game is different. Well, different no, it's not. Different. Stop. Like, stop. Wait, wait sir. Sir. It, it sir. Is. Wait, hold on, sir. Time out. Time out. Because I want to correct you. Because I want people to think this theory shit you're saying is real. How do you know what game is if you're not a student of it? Please explain. That's like me saying if I play a game of operation that I, I'm a I'm a certified surgeon. I can do heart. I can do open heart surgery tomorrow because I went on YouTube and I saw something. Are you fucking serious? Okay, for example, I'm, I'm gonna tell you like this. Say I'm in the club, right? And you know, I'm, I'm making over the females mm -hmm. and that, you know, and I'm just honest, like, yo, I'm looking, I'm trying to, I'm trying to have sex with you tonight, whatever. And and shit does pop out happening, like stuff like that happens. That's game, right? I'm getting to what I want. Like, like just, what you tell the woman you want to fuck I'm, is game? Yeah. Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm being honest, though, right? I'm being honest. Ain't right? that what y'all say? Ain't that what Mr. Lopari is speaking? Right. right. So call her. So call her. Call her. Call her. So um, I right, so what? So what? What do you want? Uh, basically, I, okay, look, Harry. So basically, I want sex from a woman, right? So basically, what I do say if I'm in the club, I'm trying to communicate with the chick. Okay, like hold on, wait, 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 wait. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. Okay, you want sex? Why do you want sex from a woman? What do you mean? Why do I? I mean, I, come on, I'm a man. I, that's what I'm there for. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, but why though? That's what I'm saying. Why? Why? No, why? Because I, I want to have sex with a female. Like, if, if I see a girl that's attractive, that's beautiful, that, that I like. It. Wait, 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 wait. Call her. Wait, sir. call her. Call her. Call her. Call her. Wait, stop. Yeah, what makes her attractive and beautiful? No, I, I like her. You know, her parents and stuff like oh, that. Oh, wait, wait. So you like you? So you find the makeup, the eyeliner, the blush, the push-up bra, the weave, the nails, and mascara beautiful, right? That's what you that's find beautiful. No, no, that's, that's what you honest. find beautiful. Be no, that's what no, no, we are being honest. That's what you find beautiful. You're in love with makeup, eyeliner, push up bras. But call her, why? Okay, call, call her. No, no, so because I, I want so, so there's a reason why I'm asking these questions. So you said, so you said you want to, so okay, why do you want to have sex with the women? Okay, but, but uh, for example, look, I say I'm in I'm in a ball, or whatever, and I'm feeling a chick, and I think she's cute and shit like that. Her body's nice. She got a fat ass. I'm I, I'm thinking with my, my head. You know what I'm saying? I want to fuck her. Okay, that's all. Okay, we got that. I'm saying, but why though? What's the reason? What's the reason? Because I just want to do it. What do you mean? I don't know. <laughs> I'm an alien. I'm an alien from another planet. Right. I'm <laughs> Why? Because you just say because you want to. That I'm. That's not a, like. Oh, that's not really. The, I'm talking about the. What's the deeper reason as to why? Oh, because I'm sexually attracted to the girl. Is that what the answer you're looking for? No, no, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just asking questions because I'm, I'm trying to get, see, the reason why I'm asking these questions, and this is what me and Steve is, is telling you about, is that the game is about you, right? So this is why I'm asking questions about you as to why you do what you do, because the why as to why you do what you do, right, is the reason why you're doing it, the underlying reason, which is what makes the woman feel you as to why she wants to fuck with you in the first place. Does that Please make sense? Clap Please clap yourself. <laughs> because caller, what because what I'm saying, because what I'm saying is because what I'm saying is like, for example, right? Let's say, let's say there's let's say there's a uh let's say you say to somebody, yo, we need to rent, we need to get out this house, right? Okay. And they say, why? And then you say, well, because I just feel like getting out. And then they might say, you know what? I, you know, I don't feel like getting out the house. Right now, ver now versus you say, let's get out the house. And the person says, why? And you say, because it's on fire. Then the person's like, oh, shit, yeah, let's get out the house. You see how the reasons as to why makes a difference in, in the action that the other person right. might take? Hmm? I see what you're saying. Um, can you give me like, like an example, like when it comes to male and female dynamics? It's no male. And, okay, there's no male and female dynamics. You're either a man in her fucking eyes or you're not. I'm saying like. You're, okay. I mean. Like, like I said, Steve, I mean, like okay. I said, I, I my, my brother, you. my brother, listen to me, my brother, day, my brother, I, 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 brother, listen, 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 listen. All right, check this out. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna slow it down for you. Listen, your the problem is, is that you're looking at the dynamics of something of an I do. Male and female interaction is an I do. That's not an I am. That's not internally your mind. An I am is mentally you. All right, it is not what you do. 
You are not your clothes. You are not your car and you are not your shoes or your money. And you're not an interaction or a dynamic with a woman when you have game. See, we, myself and uh, Lacario, Lacario and I, King's English, uh, we break the programming because most women already know, my brother, that you want to fuck. They already know that 99.9%, we take out the, you know, the hey guys out, but 99% of you guys want to fuck, okay? The question is now is, what is it about you that's going to draw me to you versus all the other guys at the bar and club who want this pussy? What is it about you that's going to set you apart? Because if all you want to do is fuck, then we can play what I call the fuck game. And you and you want to know what the fuck game is? And I talked about it yesterday, and I'll just give you a, a few of them. The game, the fuck game is when she exploits you for your money, your time, when she uses you for meals and all that other shit. Because you were under the impression that women are so goddamn stupid, like in porn, that you could just walk up to a woman and say, hey, my name is Frank. Let's fuck. And then all of a sudden, the music's going to kick off. She's going to start a button in her clothes in the goddamn club and give you some pussy. Wake the fuck up, no, that, sir. No, 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 no. Well, no, no apparently no, you not. No, apparently but, you got that idea. Please, what, but what makes what, what separates you from everybody else? Matter of fact, let me ask you a question. If LaCora and I in that same bar, do you think you really going to get that pussy? It's free game. It's then anybody can get it. Right? How, how, wait, wait, wait. If anybody can get it, then why don't you have it then? Oh, see, wait, please that's answer that I'm, question. That, hold on, Steve. Steve, listen. Uh, uh, that's what I'm telling you. Game is different for everybody. It, it, like, okay, like, says the guy like, reading like, a book. Hold on. Oh, God. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let me ask you. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Okay, let me ask you a question. Count. I'm going to show you something. Watch this. Count to five. I'm not being serious. Count to five. One, one two, three, four, five. Okay. Is that the same way with everybody all over the world was taught how to count? Or, or, or was some people in a third world country taught two, four, one, three, one, or, or, or four or something? Was, was one, two, three, four, five taught to everybody the same way in school? Yes, yes. yes it was yes, one it was. thought, but, one mind, one way, right? Right? Yes. So yes, if it's all... But it, no, it's not when it it's not when it comes to because numbers just like your alphabet is game. You are taught something how to chronologically think, sir. But see, in your fucked up head, your mind that's fucking you over is trying to get you to think what game is versus be a part of game. Lucario, what say you, brother? So, caller, this this what this. Yeah. Okay, get, get the car. Right? Go ahead. What are you gonna say? Go ahead. What are you gonna say? No. So, 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 for example, so, so, what, what differentiates, what differentiates what y'all are doing to, uh, um, compared to what I'm doing? Like, for example, say if I go out and get laid and stuff like that, but isn't that like, some part of the game as well? You know what I'm saying? Like, I, it's not like I'm, I'm getting lucky here and there. Look, like, <laughs> that, that, see, that's what see, it's your, your language is exposing you, brother. Lucky. What does that mean to get lucky? Um. You know, I'm, I'm getting laid, you know, left and right, but but there's something I'm doing that's working for me. That, that, that's what I'm trying to tell you, because I'm the ism. Like, that's, <laughs> that's, what I'm the that's what I'm trying to tell you. It's not working for you if you're getting lucky. No, but it's, it, no, I, I'm, okay, I used the wrong words. Well, no, 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 you use the right words. No, 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 you use the right words. No, call it the right words. The right word, you said it. That's what I'm, see, call her, okay. Okay, if okay, if if I squeeze an orange, what comes out of it? Of course, you're gonna get a juice out of it. Yeah. You gonna what type of juice? The orange juice. Right, because that's what's inside the orange, right? Right. Right. So when you said I get lucky, that thought was inside you. Does that make uh, sense? Uh, I used the wrong word. I, I used the no, wrong no, word. no. I, that's I, that's I amazing. Mean, I, I, didn't, I didn't mean to say that. <laughs> no. Wow. Uh, what I, That's oh, amazing. Oh, guys, guys, guys. Wow. Please, we're, 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 wow. We're, we're, so what I'm basically saying is like, for example, usually when I go out to the club or something, I, I get, you know, I get girls here and there, you know, but it's like, but, but there's something but caller, that's working for me. Why aren't the girls getting you? That's what I'm asking you. 
Why are you getting? That sounds like you're begging. That sounds like you're trying yeah, to manipulate. Though. Sorry? Um, uh, that's a disconnect with, with everybody. Because I'm, I'm sure everybody's listening to what we're talking about right now. But it's, I mean, uh, that's a disconnect. Because it's like, okay. Of course it's a disconnect I mean, until and, and, you and, learn and, the and, connection. And, you got to be a student. Okay, wait, wait, wait. If a guy says, "Oh, oh, I need your help. Cut the uh, vertebrae, cut the cut the vertebrae of this thing in his, in his body." Aren't you going to be disconnected and you'll be like, "What the fuck do I cut? What wire do I cut? I don't know what the fuck. I don't know how to operate." But how do you get a connection when you're disconnected to be a doctor by going to college, medical school, residency? getting your license. You see what I'm saying? Shit takes time. See, and call it the thing is you, 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 keep, you keep talking about the women. So, so, so what I'm saying is, is that, and this is what Steve talks about, about surface dwelling, like everything you're talking about, we get it, but it's on the surface. And when it's on the surface, that's when you're going to lose because you're already losing basically when you're on the surface, you feel what I'm saying? Meaning that you're talking about in the sense of, well, I got, I get lucky and I get girls here and there. Right. And so, so what happens is, is that you're so focused on getting the woman and getting them here and there and getting lucky. And so what we're saying is that if you're in the spot and I'm in the spot and Steve in the spot and there's other guys in the spot and, and the girl is like, well, I got this pussy and I know dudes want pussy, right? We're trying to get you to understand you're saying I'm trying to get the pussy versus right. Interacting with women and seeing if the woman is worthy enough to get your dick. That's, that's how, that's how you, you, you play the game to, to get maximum results with women. Because what happens is, is that, and this is what I'm saying. It's a mindset shift because even the words that you're saying show what type of mindset you're in. So you're like, well, I said the wrong thing. No, you said the exact thing that you're thinking because that's in your subconscious. You see what I'm saying? So your subconscious is that's in your subconscious, which is why it came out. You see what I'm saying? And that's what we're trying to say, that that thing that you said that you thought was like, oh, that's the wrong word. That is affecting your game. That's right. what you understand. And sir, and sir, you're just being influenced by women. That's the biggest problem. All, everything you're talking about is women, 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 women. So your influence is more on the feminine versus the masculine. And you don't even understand it, brother. So everything you're doing, you're doing the right way on the surface. Everything you, I can't argue on the surface because that's what you are. You're your surface on the surface. So everything you're doing is right. You get that caller? I see what y'all are saying. Uh, you know what? I see what y'all are saying, but man, this is a disconnect, man. I, it, it, okay, I, sir. I, I, it will I, I, always I be a disconnect. Okay, I, sir, I, I, I sir, see, sir. See, but, uh, it um, will always okay. be a disconnect until you decide that you want to make the connection, sir. Right. That is the problem with the majority of you guys is but that not, you're trying to see, solve that, that, something, not, sir, you're trying to solve something you don't understand or know. Wait, call, let you, me ask you a question. Do you, do you speak any other languages? No, no. Uh, English okay. Right. So now, because you don't, because you, you don't speak Spanish, right? Do you think that if somebody was Talking to you in Spanish, you don't understand what they were saying? No, definitely not. Definitely not. Right. And that's what we're trying to say. We're speaking Spanish to you right now. That's what cling we're doing. On. Motherfucking cling on to your ass. We're trying to understand. You don't you don't get it because you don't you have to learn Spanish to understand what we're saying. That's what we you have to learn game to understand. That's all Steve is saying. This is what we're trying to get you to understand. You're, you're not right. You see what I mean? That's what we're trying to get you to understand. But, but hey, but I promise you this. The programming of a woman is going to recognize what the fuck you are by how the fuck you move. But they can't recognize a man because there's no programming on something that's deep. So you just being gained by women, big dog, and you don't even realize it. Like I said, I, do, I see what y'all are saying. I do see what y'all are saying. But, I mean. No, but, no, no. There you go. You don't see it. Again. <laughs> you want okay listen it's okay your your self importance and your ego is fucking you up right now trying to force a round peg into a square hole and that's your problem when you learn game we will show you how to shape the round peg into a square hole to fit that motherfucker perfectly to you sir 
So when y'all say putting the woman first, right? Or, or, or when guys are like putting the woman first, or like you talking about like being thirsty and stuff like that. But when I go out, I mean, I just don't. That, that's not what I'm doing though. You okay, I'm sir? Thinking, all right, sir. You ready? Dope. Watch this. I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna use my dog Lucario versus you. All right, watch this. When you go out, you say, "I want to go get some pussy." I want to go meet a woman. So you automatically have women getting rent-free space in your head. Mm -hmm. Lucario says, I'm just going out. Do you see the difference? See, you're doing it for women. Lucario's just going out knowing women are going to be around. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I, 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 so I, you I, automatically I, fail because you're making it about women. Thus... You get nervous when you get around a woman versus Lucario that makes it about his motherfucking ass. I'm the bad boy of the dating game. You know what? I'm because Lucario's always getting lunch on the fucking show. I'm going to go get me something to eat. Right. And when he walks out his door, he walks into a Serengeti full of elk, zebras, deer. He he sees nothing but food in his area. So, Cole, let me ask you a question. Oh, what okay. okay. Cole, think sorry. about this. What, what makes a woman choose one man over the other what makes a woman choose one man over the other i mean if, if she's sexually attracted to, to, to the man yeah of course she's gonna go with him you know? okay so okay so let's let's let's, let's go okay let's go with that let's go with that now let's go with that okay hold on let's go with that so now what makes the man more sexually attracted that's attractive than the other guy Um, the way he's displaying himself, like the way he's coming out the female, like if he, you know, how he, you know, if he's not being thirsty, just if he's being a normal person, he's good. Okay, so 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 basically, what it is is this, right? What makes you attractive when it comes to women and you dealing with women, right? Is when she notices right. that you're not like everybody else. You understand? So what we're trying to tell you is that what you're what you're saying. And what you're talking about, you're already sounding like everybody else. You understand? And so what happens is, is that when you sound like everybody else, when you look like everybody else, when you're being like everybody else, yes, it means that you are average because the average is just like it's everybody else. It's the it's it's basically like the 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 middle thing. It's like the 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 cookie cutter thing. Right. So, yeah, you'll from time to time get some girl here or there that's going to, you know, uh, you know, interact with you or whatever. And you're going to, you know, you'll, you'll quote unquote, get lucky. You feel what I'm saying? But what happens is, is that. I, 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 I misspoke on that. But that's no, 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 but that's what I'm saying. Call it. Stop saying you misspoke. Understand that that's good that you spoke that because then it shows you where you're, where your thinking is at. Understand, understand there is, there, that's not a mistake. That's what we're trying to get you to understand. And, and understanding that it's not a mistake un, it makes you understand that that's correlated to the success that you're having in the game. That's what we're trying to say. Right. And, and again, I, I love giving you all examples of game because I know y'all don't understand this, but you know you have game when women send you things like this. When they tell you they miss you and think about you all the time. When they tell you that. See, y'all are too busy telling the women, I miss you and think about you. This is what game is. When they secretly tell you that I have all these other guys, but I love you. I got all these dinners and bank accounts, but I want to be with you. It's difficult not having you around me. I think about you. That's when you know you See, have game. Not that tight. I, I, I give you that, Steve. Like my well, game's not that tight. Well, but no, you don't. Have, okay, I, 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 <laughs> brother, I, I you don't. Have, brother, you okay? When are you gonna understand? That you don't have game. You have theory, brother. You're not a student. Listen, how can you tell me that if, if what I'm doing is working uh, for me? Okay, if I'm a doc hey, hey, if I'm a doctor and Lucario came up to me talking about, well, how do I operate? Do you think I got the right to tell him he can't he's not a doctor? If I'm a doctor? But wait, caller, you said it's working for you, but then you just you also said hold on. You also said that you get lucky. Yeah, but yeah, right. Okay, okay, but I mean, it's, I'm getting sex here and there, though. But that's <laughs> here is it? <laughs> that's no, not no, no, no. Look, 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 look. Sex here and there. But I'm, I'm, I'm getting sex, you know, here and there. But there's they, something I'm doing that's working for me. It's like that, that, that's the ism. Like something's working. For that's me. the ism. You know what I'm saying? The caller, the caller. Is it really working for you, though? 
That's what. That's what. Because see, this is this is the part. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Say that again. My client is working for, for. I mean, one of our clients. You know, yes, it works. In, yes and no. But the majority of the time, it does work. For so then, why is he calling us? You know what I mean. Then why are you calling us no, then? I, I, the reason why I'm calling you guys, I'm trying to explain to you guys, like game is. The, like the way you guys explain it is, is different. I, I I do understand what y'all are saying, but you don't. Everybody, everybody, everybody is different. different. Caller, caller, it's and not different. Example, it's not different. Results, it's is just, one, two, three, four, different. five different? Is one, two, three, four, five different for everybody? Is it different oh, for everybody? No. If it's the same, no, then what yeah, I'm saying yeah, yeah. is, when you're gamed up, you can you speak one, two, three, four, five. When you don't have game, you don't understand numbers, brother. So you're going to just make shit up. Two plus two is jelly. <laughs> Five divided by four is fucking peanut butter. You're just making shit up to because to, to, your mind, you don't understand your mind is fucking you over right now trying to tell you you're something that you're not and you actually believe this shit. Caller. Caller. You know what a water gun is? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah. Okay, now kids play with water guns, right? Because they what are they doing? They're they're trying to mimic like actual guns, right? But it's not really a gun. It's just a it's just a, a like a it's a, a a physical representation of a real gun. You feel what I'm saying? It's 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 a, a mimic of a real gun, but it's not a real gun, right? So what we're talking we're talking about using real guns, but you're using water guns. Does that make sense? I'm not gonna go. I'm, I'm not. I'm not gonna agree with that because I mean, what? I think uh, we're basically doing the same thing. But we're, 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 no, 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 caller. That's what I'm saying. We're not. That's see. That's the disconnect. You think that what we're saying and what you're saying is the same, and we're trying to tell you it's not. That's what. We're that's what we're trying to tell you. That's what. That's what we're trying to explain to you. We're trying to explain to you that see what you're doing is you're you're doing what you are doing what you think that we're doing but you're not actually doing what we're doing that's why i said water gun and the actual gun you think you actually have a real gun but water comes out your gun no bullets are coming out your gun that's what we're trying to tell you <laughs> huh. okay. right yeah. because because even in your language bro even in your language right in your language it's like because if i if i said to you like if i ask you i say yo what type of guns you have you say well uh, i got i got a a, a neon green gun Soon as you say that, I'm like, nigga, that ain't a real gun. That's a water gun. What you talking about? Yeah, Soon stick them up. Yeah, <laughs> a bag with a clear water gun. Gun is rainbow. I already know <laughs> real gun. So we ain't even talking about the same thing. So, so this is what I'm saying. When you're saying things like, "Oh, I get lucky from time to time," we're not talking about the same thing, bro. That's what I'm trying to tell you. There's two totally different things from like uh, Earth to like Neptune or Pluto, though. It's just <laughs> it's too far away. Okay, brother. Um, yeah, I mean, oh, okay, I, I do see what y'all are saying, though. I, I do, I, I agree, I agree. You know, like, yeah, okay, okay. All right, are <laughs> oh, you good? Yeah, All right, I mean, All right, caller. So we'll, we'll throw you back in, right. okay? Thank you, sir, for the call. I appreciate y'all, man. I really, I, I, I really it's, all honestly, man. it's all love. It's all respect, I, man. You know, it's all respect. I've been following y'all since, since the pickup days, man. I well, then you are fucking for, no. Whoa, well, stop then. Then don't, man, dude. This is our point. <laughs> Why are you? This is this is crazy to me. You've been following and bird watching, but you're not on the the bad boy membership or part of the man mindset. I'm not, I've been to watch. Why I'm wait? Like, oh, oh, dog. Oh, oh my God. Why <laughs> waste your time? I'm, I'm, I'm being you. Oh, 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 listen. Look, look, look. So, I, I, listen. I, I, a duck a cannot be a li Listen. A duck cannot be a lion. Sometimes he just has to realize he's a fucking duck and he can't be a lion. Just accept what the fuck you are. Because if you've been listening to us since the PUA days and you're still saying this silly ass shit, then you're just a duck, dog. Go over there, over by the lake over there, eat that grass. That's the tastiest grass, man. You're never going to get it, dog. Oh, goodbye. You, oh, my God. I can't talk to you, dog. That's sad. I, no, man. This is what I'm saying. Guys, you know I always say, Lucario, we're in the third month, the 21st day of the new year. This guy's been listening to us for decades, and his motherfucker is saying this shit? Right. <laughs>
All right, let's get to the next one. Let's see here. Another question we have here. Guys, I got questions. Um, let's see here. Um, it's funny. Uh, he has a question right here. Do I even have the room to ask y'all questions? I'm not. Well, no, there's no dumb questions to ask. That's Your questions are not dumb. It's just can you accept the answer that comes back your way? Because right. the answer might not be the thing you want to feel. It's going to be a bad punch in your chest, and it's going to either make you more emotional and effeminate by getting mad or just saying, well, okay, now it's time that I get on the bad boy membership. Now it's time I get with the man mindset, and it's time for me to become a student. Vicario, what say you, brother? And also, you know, it's the, the interesting part about this is that you guys, if y'all actually got coaching, what we're telling y'all would actually make more sense and stick. That's the see, like the other caller, he's like, Yeah, I was been binge watching your videos, and it's like, Yeah, that's cool. But remember, on YouTube, we're just touching the surface. We're not, we're not like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we're not really going deep on this shit. We're trying to tell you guys this. So a lot of times the reason why it's hard for y'all to understand, because like we talking about the the, the title of the show, why like game is easy and, and for some and hard for others. The reason why it's hard for y'all to understand, right? is because y'all are not actually coming to school. You're not doing homework. You're not studying. You're not doing none of this shit. You're not actually applying. You're not doing any of that stuff. So then so then it's so you're getting left back. You understand what I'm saying? You're in class but you're not you don't know what the 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 fuck we're on chapter 20. You still didn't even open the book yet. <laughs> we even got out of the bed to get on the bus to right. drive to the school to wait in line to go to the classroom. That's how deep right. it is. You know what I'm saying? So it, 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 that's the thing, man. No, right. that's the lie. Okay. I, I love I love how motherfuckers who are scared of women who can't say shit to a fucking woman have the nerve to say what game actually is. <laughs> it is fucking crazy to me that you would say some silly ass shit knowing behind that fake ass statement, you're chicken shit scared to talk to fucking women. But yet you want to say game is universal? I mean, I, it, it, is this is this really serious? Is this a really serious statement? <laughs> Are you serious? Let's get to the next one. When you, when shift, you shift everything, they, oh, go ahead, Lacar, you can read. Go ahead. When you shift everything to yourself, that's when it becomes clear because you be yourself and implicitly doing things from your own point of view. Oh, Jesus! You thus winning sex. Uh, thus winning sex. Oh. What's your thoughts on that, Steve? I'll, I'll go. And this is what I, 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 I guys, <laughs> again, guys, that you're you're saying that I can just go on to YouTube and watch a video of some guy in a helicopter telling me to press the red button, the blue button, step on the gas, and pull the lever up, and I can fly a helicopter, a jet, or a plane. <laughs> Are you fucking guys serious? The fact is you are shifting everything in a loser mindset. There is nothing becoming clearer to you except for the fact that you don't like yourself. You don't love yourself. You don't believe in yourself and you don't even know how to stand up for yourself. So how are you getting any shifts when you're scared of fucking women? Lucario? Well, yeah, this is this is why. All right, we'll take the call. Let me, let me see, let's see if it pops up. Uh, where is it? It's not. Uh, oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Uh, four six nine. How can we help you, sir? What's up? Hello, this is business listing verification. Oh my God, wrong. Oh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> what the fuck? Go ahead, Lacar. Go ahead. Go ahead, man. It's spam calling these numbers now. That's hilarious. <laughs> it's crazy, yeah. Um, but yeah, that, 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 yeah. The thing is, is that um, you know, this is why. Guys, gonna need to get coaching because um, there's understand like this is basically what Steve is saying is that let's listen. If you come in to this situation with the same mindset, right, you're going to be making moves and doing things with that same mindset, which is going to cause you not to actually learn or elevate because you're doing it with the same mindset. You see what I'm saying? Just like the caller earlier, you know, to just call it that we just talked to, you know, he was like, oh, but you know, I'm getting lucky. If you have the mindset that you're getting lucky, right, then you're, you know what I'm saying? You're, you're, you're going to lose no matter what you seen on YouTube and all this other stuff, because your mindset is that by sheer luck, 
you were able to make something happen with a woman. But then also the underlying thing with that is, is that you feel as if, you know, uh, the women are bestowing something upon you and you're, you're, you're just grateful to be in the presence of a woman and all that other crazy shit. Yeah. And, and answer your question, it's not being a student of the game. See, what y'all don't understand is that in order to assess, keyword assess you, we've got to sit down and talk to you and ask you personal things right. that you cannot discuss on the front end to assess where you are right now to mm -hmm. see what you've got to unlearn and learn. So there are levels and layers. But Lakari, what say to what do you say you to that? Question. Yeah, and, and and that's the thing because when you get when you get one on one coaching, that's how we basically help you out. That's that's why we say the game is about you. So how are we going to help you unless unless we're actually go, going one on one with you? That's that's the point. You see what I'm saying? Because see what we say here on this is why I said you know we're just touching the surface on YouTube because we're talking about these things, but you know we're just touching the surface on specific topics and certain things, but based off of who you are, right? You're going to need to get that one-on-one -on -one time so that you can specifically help you out in your specific situation. You see what I'm saying? So that's, that's really what it's about. It's yeah. Really and, and, and that's, and, it's, and I think, uh, the, again, I think uh, one of the biggest issues that y'all have is that it's amazing how you're scared to say and do things to a woman but you're easily buck up to a motherfucking man like an internet gangster talking all kind of shit, but yet right. you can't even say shit to a woman. Mm -hmm. But yet that, that shows you don't want to learn because learning means one has to humble himself and say, show me what I need to learn, or excuse me, show me what I need to unlearn first mm -hmm. to then begin to learn, to then have understanding so then I can actually learn. So that's why most of y'all will never get this because y'all again it it it, it makes y'all upset. This is that that femininity mm -hmm. when when you called out knowing that you're not really a fucking man, and I know that shit stings. You have all the parts of a man, but yet the men, even women. I'm telling you, women see you as a bitch. We're not calling you bitches. We're just letting you realize what women think about you because you actually think that about yourself. Right. Lucario. Right. Uh, yeah, I swear. I think I think, you know, guys should like uh, I think it should be mandatory viewing to watch the Karate Kid. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Mandatory. Yeah, that should be a right. damn there. Mandatory. Yeah, karate Kid, because I'm telling you that whole like a lot of y'all are like dead. Oh. Son, y'all y'all don't even realize what you don't yeah. know. And then, and then you, you have a mentor trying to teach you and you thinking, oh, well, well, why can't we? You understand? Know it's like we got to understand that that's what it is, is that the game, you don't even realize why certain things are the way they are when we're doing what we're doing. Cause even see, this is the thing, man. A lot of times, if you, if you, if you study, for example, like spiritual teachers and all this other stuff, and they talk about different stories of like, you know, certain masters and all this other stuff, they'll, they'll talk about how the, the, the master who's teaching the student, Right not only teaches them with words, but also teaches them with actions. You see what I'm saying? And so a lot of times, like a lot of you guys, y'all sit here and y'all cry because you'll be like, yo, Steve, why are you, why are you, uh, you know, uh, yelling at us and saying this and saying that? And I'm like, bro, don't you realize that if you don't got tough skin in this game, you, <laughs> you're, you're finished. You're so done. you're complaining about Steve, but you, <laughs> it, it, you can't, you can't, you're not going to be able to handle a woman. If you complain about Steve, women are worse. Women are worse. <laughs> women are worse. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. So, so yeah. like imagine these dudes, they're gonna walk up to a chick, they gonna be like, Hey, uh, hi, how you doing? The woman's gonna look at him like, excuse me, I'm trying to talk to my girlfriends. Like, can you leave us alone? He's gonna go and cry in the corner. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he can't take it. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all, y'all, y'all gotta let us y'all, y'all are too soft, man. I'm sorry, y'all just can't. I'm trying to toughen you up because if there's no layer of strength in you, a woman's going to recognize that and she's going to use you, walk all over you or dismiss you. Right. Exactly. They don't understand that shit. And, and, <laughs> yeah. Right. And that's what I'm saying. 
it, it, the reason it's hard for you guys is that you make it hard on yourself. Mm -hmm. You're trying to solve something that you have no understanding about. You see Lucario and I doing it. You see us talking off the top of our dome when we mm -hmm. saying things and y'all are looking and you're saying, you know what? Wow. You know what? I can do that. I don't need their help. I can just do it myself. Yeah. Right. You can be whatever you want to be from the comfort of your own fucking home. But as soon as you walk outside your door into that Serengeti, it shows you your truth, Lucario. What say you, brother? Right, exactly. And this is only telling you guys, like, you know, when you're out here in the real world doing shit and making shit happen, right, understand that you're going to be in situations where you're going to need to know how to, na to navigate things. And if you if you're scared, if you're weak, if you're all over the place, if you're emotional, you're not going to be able to make anything happen because, see, I don't think see this is the thing. Y'all are not out there enough to actually realize what's really happening out there. This is why a lot of these dudes, the funny part is a lot of these dudes, they're so weak. This is why they run off to different countries. This is why they complain about women online, because they can't take it you understand what i'm saying they can't take it and the thing is is that the reason why they're in these situations is their own fault because check this out every guy is not you know in that situation because you have men who actually are in situations where women love and respect them where women actually wait on them hand and foot where women are are, are super submissive to those men and so if you're not experiencing that and then your solution to that is to bitch, moan and complain or run to somewhere else, then that's just that's what you're going to get. That's that's your situation. Ain't nobody I else know, for you. I don't know why y'all make these fucking bullshit ass quotes. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. I, I don't understand why the fuck. What the fuck does that have to do with the fact that you're a loser? See, I, I said something yesterday, Lucario, a, a, a Steveism, mind you, mm -hmm. that the problem with you motherfuckers is you can't get stronger in anything until you attack your weaknesses mm -hmm. because it is your weaknesses that are holding you down from becoming the man that you need to be. So what the fuck does what you kill, what, what, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger? Do you know what? You need to get your ass and just just go to the store and get some Tampaxes. Go to the Lifetime channel and watch it because all that bullshit motivational shit that you listen to are why you're a bitch. Because the same shit you're saying right now, go ahead and get in front of a woman. Well, what, what doesn't kill me makes me stronger. Uh, hi. I I I just just wanted man get your bitch ass out with that silly ass shit. Stop saying stupid shit, Lucario. What we, <laughs> man, how, why do they say that shit, man? Why do they talk this way? You know, it's it's, it's uh catchphrases and shit. You know, that, that's, <laughs> catch yeah. But hey, hey I'm good. You go to the Chinese store and and go get some uh I don't know Fu Manchu rice, whatever the fuck. And make sure you get a handful of fortune cookies. Mm -hmm. And every day, just open up your fortune cookie and read your fucking fake ass fortune and shit. Right. Okay? Because the, <laughs> shit you, the shit you saying is showing why you a book smart motherfucker, man. 857, what's up, man? How can we help you? What's going on, Steve and Lucario? How y'all doing? Chilling. What up? Yeah, I'm, I'm just calling uh, because I have uh, the Bad Boy uh, membership and I have uh, uh, the Man Mindset, mindset uh, Masterclass. Um, All right. So I have both of them. And I'm just calling to let guys know that I, I used to be one of the motherfuckers that was just bird watching. And it's not going to work. If you really want to fucking learn this shit, you got to humble yourself and be a student and just get coaching, man. That's what you need. Mm -hmm. you just gotta humble yourself man I'm, I'm applying every day and, and learning more about myself and you know that's the best thing that i did and you know humble myself when i don't know shit and just learn man that's it that's all you motherfuckers gotta do man if you don't know shit just shut the fuck up and listen that's it 
That's hardest, all I wanted to say. He man. called us the hardest thing to do, but it's crazy how they shut the fuck up and listen to a woman, though. Ain't that crazy? Right. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. yeah, for real. For real. That's, That's real, real shit. Mm -hmm. You know, I was bird watching all the time trying to do it. Think like it's gonna work because it's gonna you're gonna run into some shit that you know it's not gonna work, man. You just gotta learn about yourself. And for you to learn about yourself, get coaching, man. You're gonna yeah. learn a lot. Absolutely, brother. And you're gonna realize how stupid you are for talking all this shit. Oh, they don't like even. The, yeah, they don't the call, realize it. Yeah. Like the caller that you, that, that you you just hanged up on, the one that was talking to you about, you know, him going to the club and all of this bullshit, and then he's calling asking you questions. <laughs> yeah, he's calling asking us questions. As a matter of fact, it seemed like he wants us to. He wants validation. He was looking mm -hmm. for validation. Oh yeah, yes, he did want. He wanted validation for you to agree with him that he, he's getting bitches. So what? So anybody can get this. Hey, 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 you, hey, you can throw a rock out your door and get a motherfucking woman. They're, they're easy. Pussy has always been easy to acquire. Right. It's always been easy, especially mm -hmm. the women who exactly. love to fuck. What is she doing for you though? What is she doing for you? There you go. Mm -hmm. Real shit. Real shit. Well, that's that's all I wanted to say, man. Uh, uh, you know, both like both memberships are great. You know what I'm saying, like. I advise guys to check it out, man. And, you know, if you want to change your life and, and change your mindset, man, just, you know, just get coaching, man. Just get the membership and you'll be all good. Or, or call her. They can just go to YouTube and listen to some fucking loser try to complain about women. Right. <laughs> yeah. yeah, for real. For real. I've never been that too until like to, before that. I always realized that you, you know, I was gravitated to the truth, man. Be like, oh, okay. These motherfuckers are talking some real shit. And if you're a bitch, it's going to offend you. Well, but even if it offends you, you know, that that's what's going to make you learn, man. And just, you know, stop being a bitch and just, you know, face yourself, man. Face your fear. Well, just, this, brother, this, like brother. Mario and, and, and Steve is going to teach you how to, you know, brother. confront yourself and, you know, find who you are, man. And that's what it's about. Most just, guys don't want to do that. Yeah, just remember, you can't find your truth when you're living a lie, brother. That's just how it is. Right. That's just how it is. Right. All right, right. brother. We'll throw you. We'll throw you back in. But thank you for the call, brother. Okay. Thank you, man. Okay. All right. All right respect. Thanks. Respect. Uh, wait. Let's bring in. Uh, wait. He hung up. So. Uh. Okay. So this guy is um asking how is pussy easy to acquire. <laughs> that just sounds funny like I mean, <laughs> oh my goodness man guys nice. oh wow that's that's like oh, jesus oh, listen yeah. listen see it's easy to to acquire because the women want to give it to you when you're a man that's, that's, that's how it's easy to acquire see okay understand this think about this see okay Think about how bad you like you think about like you guys, you go out, you see hot chicks, you want to fuck like, damn, I'll smash that. She hot, blah, 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 blah. Right. Women think the same way when they're around men, they're sexually attracted to. They think the same way. This is why women be talking about dudes in, in fucking, you know, sweatpants and shit. And, you know, when a guy talks to her a certain way, she gets hot and all that. That women are the same way. Women, women want to fuck. They like to have sex also. That's why we, we have them t-shirts, women love sex, because they love they love sex. They so love the thing is, the reason why it's hard for some guys, again, the, the game is hard for some guys, or it's hard for some guys to get ass and some guys to get shit popping, right? Is because they're not that guy that women see as attractive. This is what I was talking about earlier. And the reason why. You are the guy who women don't see as attractive is because you're scared of women. You're scared to talk to women, right? You don't work on yourself. You're worried about everything that the woman is saying and doing. You're you're not valuing who you are. All of these things as to why you're not attractive, which means you're not attracting. You feel what I'm saying? If you feel that we're getting mad at callers who don't want to learn game, then this is not the right place for you. Mm -hmm. If right. you if you actually feel that we're getting mad at callers who are not trying to learn game because learning game is something you do on the back end. You dumb fuck mm -hmm. learning game and being a student of the game is something you do on the back end. Right. But if you feel that we're getting mad, um, I can give you a happy sticker and we <laughs> give me an address so I can send you a bouquet of flowers and saying, sorry that I made your pussy hurt. 
<laughs> what are you talking about, goof ass motherfucker? No, call call in uh Kennedy, call in. You yeah, know what I'm saying? In, right, but that's what I'm saying. Call in. Yeah, call in. But again, this is why women, this is why women, yeah. Hey, this is why yeah, it's grown man shit. Right. Yeah, y'all, y'all, y'all want y'all want to know that this grown man shit. Okay. Yep, mm -hmm. you're right. I'm very emotional and I'm so emotional. I'm gonna block you. Goodbye. That's an emotional move. There you go. I'm emotional. <laughs> bye bye. All right. Hilarious. Yeah. It's crazy, man. It, it's 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 amazing how uh, a lot of these guys out here um, just uh, they 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 should see why women mm. don't want them. Right. Look at how y'all think. Do you think a woman wants to be with a guy that gets in his pants? His panties get tight when he's around a fucking real man. See, right. y'all never, see, the thing is, the car, they've never been around real men to know what a real man is. They mm. think they're loser ass friends or men because they're always complaining and cuck holding circle jerks and shit like that. What say you, man? <laughs> but again, that's all I was saying before. Like, if, if you, if you feel some type of way just about this type of stuff, I'm telling you, you're not going to be able to maintain anything with a woman. I, I, I keep trying to tell y'all. See, a lot of dudes, what they're doing is they're in situations, right, where they've never actually experienced being in a relationship or dealing with multiple women or whatever it is. So y'all don't really know the reality of it. And 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 some dudes are not equipped to deal with that reality. He said, why should a person call in if they're going to get judged for not having game? <laughs> oh, God, <man. laughs> See this. This is this is this is why this is why you, you can see now why a lot of other channels be blowing up because the, what other channels do is they get you they get you to tune in and they're like yeah guys you know it's oh, yeah. women out here and their hypergamous nature that's why see these these three oh fours they're just out here fucking with all these <laughs> and they make all these bad decisions so it's not your fault that you're not getting asked. <laughs> Because she just has mental problems because she had too many dicks in her. That's why you can't get her because you know she can't pair bond. That's why you can't get her. It's not because you're, you're not a you're not. It's nothing wrong with you. It's the Western women. That's why you got to go overseas because the Western women are fucked up. So this, this is the type of shit I love to hear because you're you're talking about getting judged. Why are you worried about getting judged? Mm -hmm. you don't, don't you want to get fixed? Right, you worried about getting judged because you give a fuck about what what, what motherfuckers think. Exactly, and, and, first and, learning. Right. And because you you care about what motherfuckers think, that shows that you got those insecurities, and you're still worrying about others' opinions of you because you're looking for validation. So right. that, that's why you need to be calling in because you got. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What, what, why talk to a woman when that fucking woman's gonna judge your bitch ass? Exactly. Uh, right. Why, why, hey, hey, why do that? Why, mm -hmm. hey. Why, why go to a job or an interview when they're going to judge your fucking ass? Mm -hmm. You dumb motherfucker. This is, I, I this, dog, dog, just, look, just keep eating grass, bro. Look, 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 you go have a job. Look, let me tell you, this is your job. Your job is to find that nice woman that's going to walk all over your ass, dog you out, and use you. And mm -hmm. your job is to buy her shit, give her a house, or picket fits, 2.5 kids, the dog, and the pie out of the window. Mm -hmm. And what you need to do is hold her legs up for motherfuckers like us that's going to be fucking her mentally, emotionally, and physically. So you have a job to do. You know you know what you are. You, you just Look, you should know this is not for you. You know your job is to be a bitch. Uh, he said, if a man has anger issues or a short temper, would coaching help, or is it better to get therapy? I mean, you, you. <laughs> well, well, I, I, I would ask Russell this question: What are you so fucking mad about? Right. And why do you have such a short temper? Mm -hmm. I mean, if you can answer that question, to call in because it, it doesn't make any sense because it. it I'm, and I'm not saying this with love, sir. It sounds like there's a lot of mommy in you. It mm -hmm. sounds like there's a lot of mommy in you. So what I'm saying to you is, we're asking you seriously, not joking. What are you so mad about? And what and what triggers your short temper? If you can answer that question, sir, we'll be happy to answer you. But I'm, we're serious. We're not we're not joking around, man. Seriously, just answer that. So um, let's see here. Uh, let me see any of questions. Okay, yeah. 
Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we're just trying. Yeah. If you can let us know or call in, and let us know, because uh, your short temper might come from and stem from mommy. You know, a lot of y'all guys have a lot of mommy in you. And that's right. why I always say it's OK for women to be mad because they're they're emotional. They should go through ups and downs. But, you know, the one thing I was talking about, Lucario, where these guys really fuck up is where a lot of these guys go wrong is a lot of these guys sit around and they would say things like, um, uh, you know, the worst thing y'all can do, guys, I'm going to give you all a secret I told, talked about yesterday. Stop crying about shit online. Y'all right. giving your fucking weaknesses away. Stop crying about, well, I lost my dog Toto. I lost my turtle. I feel sad. I, I feel gloomy. I, I didn't get the job and all this other shit. Mm -hmm. stop putting your business on the street because when a woman goes online and looks at your fake profile with your mm -hmm. fake ass picture and your fake ass words they're going to go right to your facebook and instagram and read the silly shit you're saying and what mm -hmm. you're saying is going to be your truth the car right. would say you on this brother right and then either she ain't gonna fuck with you or she is gonna fuck with you and then fucking play you and then you're gonna be crying even more <laughs> it's usually yeah. What happens, you know? No, no, I, 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 and I respect that. See, I respect that. At least you're being honest. See, this is, this is good. Mm. This, this is good. He says, I find myself getting annoyed easily, especially trying to date. But my brother, the, the anger that you're getting is coming from an emotional I do. It's an emotional. Because mm. here's the thing. You're trying to date, but have you dated yourself mentally? And, and and I think your your frustration comes from you are trying to push yourself out in a world in which you have no idea about yourself. But Lakar, what say you about this man right here? Yeah, I mean, well, the thing is, you know, if you're getting annoyed when you're trying to date, right? That has that has nothing to do with <laughs> with the woman. You're see things things that's going on outside of you is 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 not really the thing that makes you feel the things you feel inside because the same situation you're you're in another person will be in that same situation and wouldn't be annoyed so so that annoyance is coming from inside you so you got to look at yourself and say well why do i feel this way and a lot of times you feel this way because you're looking for validation through the interactions you're having with the woman which is why you're so annoyed because you're looking for her to do a certain thing so that you can feel good about your situation. And, and, right. and it's annoying to you because you're like, man, if she would just call me back, then I wouldn't be so annoyed, man. If she would just sleep with me, I wouldn't be so annoyed. And it's like, that's coming from you feeling a certain type of way about the outcomes of these situations. But yeah, real, real quick. Shout out to our dog, Zag, man. Shout out. He's going to be game. Kings, our dog, Zag, man. Oh, he's exactly. He's, he's, he's too attached to wanting women to like him. He's seeking acceptance. Exactly. Right. Right. He's, yeah. And, and, and the thing is, Russ, is the thing is, like Lucario saying and Zag is saying, you're defining yourself through a woman's action. Mm -hmm. you're, you're saying that what she does is going to define my life. What, what she does is going to shift my thinking. If mm -hmm. I don't get what I want, she's going to, she is drawing out emotions in me. Do you see what we're saying, my brother? A right. woman should never draw anything out of you except mm -hmm. your nuts, your cum. That's the <laughs> only thing she should be drawing out of you. But when you are defining yourself based off of a woman, that's where your frustration is coming from because this is where game and having a motherfucker teach you, my young man. This is because we we, we you don't need therapy to understand yourself. We, you mm -hmm. gotta you gotta get with somebody that is gonna show you to stop uh allowing women to def to stop allowing you to define yourself through a woman. Lakara, what say you, brother? Right, exactly. And that's and that's what we're saying for a lot of you guys out there. The reason why y'all be frustrated is because y'all making it about the women. This is what this is what y'all don't get, man. It's like, see, this is this is the thing. A guy who has weak ass game, right? He makes it about the women because he's looking for women for validation. The guy who has tight game, he validates himself. So it's never it was never about the women at all in the first place, anyway. So there's no frustration there because the guy who makes it about himself understands that his dealings with women, right, 
are always going to be how he wants it and needs it to be because he understands that he doesn't have a problem with interacting with women at all because he has that abundance regardless. Right. Meaning if this, if this, if I need to charge a six to the game and get rid of her, I can replace her. You understand? Mm -hmm. See, the guy who has weak game, he's holding on to the woman because he thinks he can't replace her. He's like, he feels lucky to even have her there in the first place. And so yeah. that's the difference. And so what, what, what a lot of you guys don't understand is that that right there is the thing that makes you unattractive to women when you're trying to hold on to her. Right. And then that's what makes her want to get away from you. And then that makes you even more insecure. And then that makes you more needy, which will make you hold on more to the next chick. Whereas the other guy is like, listen, I, I, you know, I'm doing me. I understand, you know, what it is. I understand shit is about me. I'm doing my own thing. And there's always going to be an abundance. And I always know that I can make shit happen the way I want it to happen, regardless of anything. So he's not worried about none of that shit because he's always just doing him. Right. And, and Russell, the thing is, is that uh, I'm sorry they were doing that, but sir, you're not your mother and you're not your father. Okay. Right. And the fact that they get angry and fight each other has nothing to do with you. That is something they do. You, you, you can't assume that because my father and mother are arguing and fighting that I have to get angry and be that way. It's just, unfortunately, your father never taught you how to be a man because a man doesn't get angry at a woman. He dismisses her. A man doesn't beat, hit, punch, belittle or yell at women. They just, men don't do that. So you got a false sense of a reality because your father, and I'm not saying this to be mean, he just wasn't a man in your eyes. And you thought that what he was doing is what men do. Men don't get angry, yell, fight, hit, punch, or do anything to a woman. We just dismiss them. So your anger is you're looking at your mom and dad, and then you're looking at you, and then you look at women. So there's a few layers of this. But no, no, no. Wait, hold on. Wait, let me say this. No, stop real quick. Raw, wait, wait, let me let me say something. See, I, I, I'm going to get in your. Why don't you shut the fuck up? Because you're not asking any fucking questions. You're not calling in. So don't knock this motherfucker for being honest. He's being for the first time on the show on this show today. Somebody's actually being honest. So why don't you get out your why don't you fucking call in or shut your bitch ass up? Don't get me to talk about that violent shit. Because where the fuck are you talking about, bitch? So shut your fucking ass up or get the fuck out, motherfucker. That's what I'm saying, man. Hey, anyway, y'all motherfuckers want y'all want to talk shit about a motherfucker being real, but y'all motherfuckers ain't real. At least this motherfucker's being honest, and that's why we're talking to him and we're not downing him or dogging him out because he's doing the one thing you bitch motherfuckers won't do. So you want to talk about a violin, bitch? Why don't we look at your weak fucking life, dumb fuck? I'm sorry. Go ahead, Lucario, man. <laughs> Motherfucker. Man, you know, again, it's, it's just, you know, at the end of the day, what what is going to really improve you guys' situation is really understanding the game is about you. That's that's yes. what we keep trying to reiterate to y'all over and over and over again. And this is why even when that guy called in earlier and we said that, listen, he, he you know, he he's he's surface level. Because he's still he's still thinking about the women. He's still making it about the chicks. And this is what we're trying to say. We're, we're saying that, see, when you make it about you, chicks and the women are a byproduct of that. So you don't have to make it about them because you're already making it about you, which makes you acquire that, attract that. This is what we're trying to tell you. That's what makes yeah. you that attractive man. Is that and, and, and the good news, Russ, we want to say to you, you'll be a perfect student, dog. You'll be a perfect student because you have no ego, you have no self-importance, and you actually want to learn. So I commend you, young man. I, I, I really, really commend you. Unlike all these, uh, most of these guys in here talking shit and just saying shit, you actually want to learn. And I, and I think that is a, a great thing. But understand, uh, some some people do come from uh, uh, abuse and fighting. Uh, but first, hold on a second. We got to, excuse me, I got to shout out our brother, Miles Cunningham. Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, Miles, you're in the building. Yeah, Miles, don't tell me. Don't worry, Miles. I already know, Miles. Stop, Miles. I got it. I got it. Don't even say it, Miles. The Game King Seminar. <laughs> Coming in with Tuesday. Where's <laughs> Miles Cunningham? Taekwondo. I'm sorry, go ahead, Lucario. <laughs> April 2nd is the, the show. 
Myself, Moss Cunningham, Taekwondo Rumbles, and Kerry K. Zagan is going to be in the motherfucking building. In the building. Yeah, bro. See, I got you, uh, Miles. You had to tell Miles. Miles popped in that motherfucker. Said, Come on, Steve. Where the fuck is it at? I'm on it, Miles. I had it. I had it locked in. As soon as I saw you, I clicked that goddamn button, motherfucker. I got you, bro. So, yeah. So, we, we're just saying to you guys out here that um, you guys have to understand that you are not your parents, okay? So when a lot of y'all guys, when a lot of y'all guys uh, out here uh, are mad or upset at what your parents are doing, you're not your parents. You don't have to do that kind of stuff. That can be a learning thing, but you should never, guys, you getting upset at a woman is on the track of, I'm not saying you're going to, but it's the same track or the same street as emotional abuse, physical abuse, and other things when you are, when a man should not be in his fucking feelings like that. Lakari, right. what's in you, brother? Right, real shit. You know, you just gotta, you gotta, you see, you gotta just understand yourself. Once you understand yourself, a lot of these things, when we talk about game, is gonna make more sense. This, this is what yeah. we try to oh, yeah. understand. A a right. Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. The further away you are from yourself, that's when you get confused, and that's when it becomes hard for you. Because we're talking about, you know, why it's hard for others. It's hard for other guys when it comes to this game is because they're stepping further and further out and away from who they are. And then that's yeah. when things get all complicated and confusing. You feel what I mean? Yeah, so. and, and and always remember the the thing uh, that's very important uh, uh, in all of this. Okay, um, is that uh, wait a second? Wait, 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 wait. wait what, what the fuck, Mac? What are you talking about, man? <laughs> I, I don't, I, what are you, what are you, you talking, Mac? What, Mac? 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 What are you talking about? Mac, just relax, okay, buddy. Just, just relax. It's okay. Don't, <laughs> Mac. Just stay focused, buddy. That's the that that's a lot of feminine energy there. Just relax, yeah. brother. Okay, okay. You know why we promote and push? Because we have a, a admiration and respect for these other men that we want everybody that are men to do well. So I don't understand what what was the problem here. Mm -hmm. I, I I'm glad Miles and Lucario are doing what they're doing, but. What are you talking about? You, you don't even know what you don't know. So just, just relax. Pump your brakes and just relax, okay? You, you, it, it just doesn't make any sense. Just relax, okay? So anyway, but th th but but this is. Do y'all see why women don't fuck with y'all? Mm. Y'all must have focus and be focused. Do do y'all? I I know they came up with this ADD shit and and started like veering off and shit mm. but stay focused on yourself do it right please guys i'm gonna start saying be russell <laughs> can y'all be in russell i'm gonna give you props on this one my brother be russell mm. go and, and 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 actually uh come here to learn and stop worrying about other men and stop asking bullshit ass questions Russ was an authentic person that actually wants to learn, period. Mm -hmm. I'm questioning why aren't y'all doing what Russ is doing? Right. Other than asking questions that fucking don't even matter. Mm -hmm. What does it matter if I'm not going to New York? How do you know I might get a ticket and just fly up there just to hang out? Y'all don't fucking know. But if right. I do or I don't, why do you give a fuck? What does that have to do with you got, you got, well, let me, let me explain something. You got five motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. That are there to lace you up. <laughs> why, the, why the fuck are you worried about the ones who are not there and worry about the ones who are there and get your notebook and your crayon and start learning, you dumb motherfucker? Y'all right. see why I gotta punch y'all motherfuckers in the chest? <laughs> God damn, Lucario. It, it doesn't, <laughs> it, it, it doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. It, 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 doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. That's, that's what happens in this game, man. Dude, dudes will be taking a focus off, off, off. No, the shit, you know, some other shit. Hold on, motherfucker. You got a lot of mommy in you. You a bitch. You got a lot of mommy in you. Hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up. You and Saint DS. Hold on. Let me let me say something about you two little weak, you little weak ass bitches. You motherfuckers won't call in because you know why? Because you know as soon as you open your mouth, I'm gonna break your bitch ass down. You mm -hmm. ain't going to ask a question because you know as soon as you ask a question, I'm going to show you why you ain't shit. But yeah, you want to see this is what bitches do. 
Y'all want to knock motherfuckers. Well, you know what? Go find your mommy, motherfucker. Get the fuck out of here. Y'all motherfuckers want to sit here and y'all want to judge a person who actually wants to learn. That's crazy to me. Mm. This month, Russell came in. You know what he said? He said, fuck the chat room. I'm going to really do something. I'm going to start asking questions about me because I need help. Fuck the room. And he did. He came in and, and fucking did that. Okay. And look at this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You, oh man, soft. Yeah. Yeah. You already saw. How can you be something that you already are, motherfucker? Get your ass out of here. Anyway. Anyway, Lacar, we'll say you, man. We'll say you, brother. <laughs> man, you know, uh, listen, listen, guys, I just want y'all to understand that you got to focus. That's why, you know, again, we talk about the game being hard for other people. One of the things that makes it hard is that you're not focused. Mm -hmm. you're not focused on what's important. So, you know, you're talking about other things that ain't got nothing to do with nothing else instead of focusing on what needs to be focused on so you can actually make something go down. So that, that's very important when it comes to this game. Oh, four has a question. Living uh, in my truth and not running from myself uh, gives me room for a better tomorrow. And game. No, no, it doesn't. Okay, you're, you're, okay, remember your truth is not actually the truth. It's a truth, okay? So that means that your truth is based off of what you see yourself, how you see the world. So I'm not trying to deter you from your truth, but your truth is why you are living a lie. Do you see what I'm saying? In yourself, because you don't know your truth until you get out. A lot of you guys in 04, it's a good question. Your truth comes from your education. You think you are your degree or your education. That's your truth. Right. But the truth of the game is something you don't know yet. So if you're living in your truth, then when you meet a woman, you're going to get lost in a false truth because you don't know how to operate yourself around that person. Good question. But uh, what say you, uh, Lucario, on that? Yeah, I would say also, too, uh, sometimes you got to you gotta understand or be aware of what the truth actually is. Because, for example, let's say, let's say you, you, you're dealing with a woman and she's real. The truth is she's dealing with you because you got money and you lead them with your wallet. But you think the truth is she actually likes you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yeah. now so now because you don't have the awareness that the reality is she's using you for your money, you think the truth is she's with you because she likes you. And so that, that not having that awareness is the thing that's going to get you caught up. So you actually have to be able to really understand yourself in order to see what the reality is. That's, that's right. Right. And if you think about uh, uh, truth for a second, uh, most of your, your truth is sometimes tied into your emotions and how you feel. Mm -hmm. So if you are angry at the world or you're frustrated with yourself and you don't know how to understand yourself, you will easily go to YouTube and find someone complaining about women. And you will cling to that because you feel that that is actually truth, that Women are bad. Women are evil. Things have changed. Modern women this and modern women that. Like they haven't been fucking before the internet and shit. Like mm -hmm. they haven't been giving pussy up and stuff. So right. you, you will follow somebody else's truth. But when you're a student of the game, your mentors will teach you how to learn your truth by learning a side of yourself that you don't even know you have. Lucario, what say you, brother? Mm -hmm. No, that's real shit. And that, this is and this is why we 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 uh we tell you guys, right, to get coaching. This is why we tell you guys to to actually be a student of the game because then you'll actually understand what it is about you. This is why I was asking a question to the guy when he called and I said, you know, why do you want to do this? What what's the reason? What's going on? But what's the underlying situation behind that? So that's why we ask those questions. You know what I'm saying? Um, you said, can you clarify the clip where, when Rosebud says he wants to hear a woman's voice so he can know how to get at her? Sounds like he is saying there are multiple ways to uh, get at a woman. No, what he's saying in the clip when he was saying, you know, he's basically saying that when he when he basically is interacting with a woman and he hears how her voice sounds. Right. He understands by her response where she's coming from. You understand what I'm saying? And so he knows all different types of women in all different types of ways that women come at situations and, and how she's thinking. Just like when y'all call up, 
we can tell by the sound of your voice or the shit you're saying what's going on with you. That's what we're talking about. Yeah. And, and well, one thing before I answer your question, I don't understand why you have a picture of another man that's not you. That, 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 that's disturbing to me, but I'm going to try to bypass that and move on to your question. I'm really disturbed that you would have a picture of another man on your 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 thing that's that's really disturbing but i'm trying to focus i'm sorry you just threw me off but anyway uh that's why i always talk about the studio shifting up and shifting down as a man a man knows when to be smooth romantic sensual sexual romantic or shift down to be kinky dirty nasty and naughty so it's just mm -hmm. a thing as your studio is a, as a shift down like you're in a you're uh in front of a track machine uh, i mean mm -hmm. a mixer you you just have to know how See, you have to know yourself enough to know when you turn something up and when mm -hmm. you turn something down. Okay, but right. please, please take that picture off. Please, that's not. <laughs> that's, that's weird to me. Why? Why would a guy post another guy's face on his photo? That's right. That's uh, that's un that's weird to me. How much time do you have, Lacar? Where are we at on time? I know you got. Where are we at? Right. Another 10 minutes. So guys, I call out 10 minutes. 10 minutes to go, guys. Call we got 10 more minutes to go. 833-859-8744. 833-859-8744. So if you guys want to call up, call up. You feel what I'm saying? And make that shit crack. You feel what I mean? If you got a question, put a Q in the chat and we'll get to it. You feel what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, guys, you got a question, go ahead and ask. All right. Um uh so yeah, uh just uh let us know and uh, yeah, I have a question, put a Q in there and we'll we'll bring you in. Um Let's see here. All right, here we go. I think this is a thing. It's not real. Um, four six nine. Can we help you, sir? I don't think it's a real number. Four six yeah, nine. This is uh, this is me. This is Jerron. I was, I was just the one in the chat. You told me to call in. All right, Jerron. Okay, what's going on, Jerron? I don't know. You told me to call in. So okay, I don't even know what you said. Okay, well, I forgot about you so fast. What did you say? I was the one who made the comment about Russell. With the one him having. So why? Okay, well, okay. Let me ask you a question. You ain't asking their question about the fact that you ain't even game the fuck up. You ain't doing anything but ridiculing motherfuckers that are actually trying to learn. Mm -hmm. You don't know shit about women, shit about game, but yet, who the fuck do you think you are to judge somebody that's trying to get help? Are you finished? No, I'm not finished. I can go on for hours if you like, but no. I'm just asking no, you a question. Man, I'll, I'll respond whenever you're done. Go ahead. No, well, well, I can tell. No, no, tell, tell. I don't want you to respond. What is your question? What, what, what is your problem? Because I know you need help. I can hear in your fucking voice you need a lot of help. So, what is your question? I need help. Help with what exactly? Go ahead. Well, if you need help, then why the fuck are you wasting your time in the room with us? If you got so much fucking game, why are you wasting your time in the room with us? Because I ain't got shit else to do. Today. Oh my, my whole way, right? You ain't got shit else to do, <laughs> right? <laughs> Thank you, Cario. No, I'm not gonna say nothing else. Go ahead, Lucario. <laughs> what's your response? Like, what's what's your what's like what's on your mind, bro? What's going on? I mean, he assumes. I guess he assumes like a lot. So I guess he assumes I don't have game, but it's like all of a sudden you got. All well, okay, all right. I don't have game. Teach me how to talk to a woman. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Come on. We go off the top of our head. This is what we're gonna do, Mister. You got it. Anybody in the chat room, the first one that pops up, something the woman says. We'll do it a cappella, and we're going to see who has game and who hasn't. So we're going to take the first guy that makes a, a statement from a woman to you, to, to both of us. Uh -huh. You get to go first, and I'll go second, okay? So, guys, Ooh. throw up his Hold on, guys. You missed a game. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. We're going to see how much game you got. So, one, guys, please tell us something the woman's going to say that throws you off, and then we're going to go ahead. Okay, let's see here. Um... A woman no, said, a woman said, oh, wait, a woman says, I'm not looking for that right now. What do you say? She says, looking for what? All right, I'm sorry. Let's get to this one. All right, we have to get to know each other. Get to know each other for what? <laughs> why? All right, let me give you another one. Why are you, why are you talking to me right now? I can't even like what, what's the context of these questions? Is well, no, 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 this, no, wait, 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 wait. You have game. You should be able to respond like you will respond to a woman that says this to you. I'm just giving well, you stuff. Like game will, I will tell you that you need context. You can't just go off a random. Place. You that's what game is. You should be able to go off the top of your head. Come on, I'm gonna give you another one. I know you got it. What about this one? I just got out of a relationship and I need time to heal. What are you gonna say to that one? 
take all the time you need. You hit me up when you're ready to come and do this. I mean, I'm moving on to other shit. Like, whatever. I mean, this, this shit ain't hard. Dude. It is I'm hard. Like, Why are you talking to me right now? You told me to call in. I'm no, I'm saying a woman is saying that to you. I mean, I'm not. I'm saying what women are saying. I want you to reply. I'm not that kind of. I'm not that type to fuck quickly. Okay. I mean, a lot of y'all say that. I mean, I mean it is what it is. <laughs> oh my, Lucario, I can't take the wheel, bro. <laughs> so what? So what? So what was your issue with Russell? I didn't, I didn't have no issue with Russell. I just, I just made fun of what he was saying that Steve got on his grill. I mean, I'm, I'm cool. Okay, so, why, so, why, so why'd you wait? You, you, you want to know why? You want to know why I got my so-called feelings? You know why I got my so-called feelings? Because be, no, because when bitches are saying bitch shit, I gotta call out bitch shit. That man asked for help, but because you who need help, wait, hold on, I'm hold on, I'm not finished. Because you that needs help, you want to laugh at somebody that actually wanted help. He's the first guy that actually wanted help. Okay. And so let me hey. ask you, so weren't you the same one who was getting at Ethan when he called in the other day talking about his therapy and shit? You told this nigga to off You had all the jokes in the world. Tell him to off himself. The fuck you mean tell him to you off know, himself? You, you know, you, you I know told him to did. fuck off. Yeah, but where's your sympathy at? Wait a second. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay, sir, sir, sir. The sympathy moved when he started questioning my my family. That's when the sympathy moved. He started the shit. If you fucking pay the fuck attention, mm -hmm. he came oh, in. He came in with hold on, hold on, motherfucker, hold on, motherfucker, hold on, motherfucker. He came in disrespectful. So when he came in disrespectful, he got exactly what he deserved. So what the fuck are you talking about? So wait. So if he's disrespectful, I'm supposed to turn the other cheek like your bitch ass. Wait, wait, I'm supposed to turn hey, wait, I'm supposed to be like you and turn the other cheek? Get the fuck out of here. I don't turn the other cheek. So call it. Hey. So what so what's so what's what's the issue? What's the issue? I just told you I don't have an issue. He told he told me to call in. I was saying what I said in the chat, but then y'all block then y'all then y'all block me or something. Like no, we did you a favor out. because you got game, you don't need us. You got you gamed up, you don't need us. We did you a favor, big dog. Now you got time to do nothing. Yeah. So why so why, why, why were you making fun of Russell? I wasn't making fun of Russell. I was making fun of the bullshit he was saying. What was so what was so funny about what he was saying that was bullshit? Nigga talking about oh I got you know I witnessed my mommy and my daddy. That's the, that's his truth, mother. Wait 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 wait. wait, wait. If, no, wait, it's, it, wait, 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 who asked you if you, wait, wait, who asked you what the fuck you care about? When, when, wait, when did it become the J show where your, your opinion mattered? Hold on, sir. When did it become the J show where your opinion mattered for somebody who is actually trying to get help? The one thing you and the most of these motherfuckers ain't trying to do. If you're uh, trying to get help, that motherfucker would have called a third. No, he how do you know he's a okay? That that again, there you go with your fucking judgments. He's asking a <laughs> yeah, simple right. it's the proper judgment. Dude. Right. Well, okay. How old are you, big how old are you? I'm old enough. There you go. You can't even tell us your age. Goodbye. You, you, what kind of man can't even tell us? Get the fuck off the show. Can't even tell us his age. See that shit? He what did he say? I'm old enough. Y'all see that shit? <laughs> see, mother motherfuckers, motherfuckers get mad. <laughs> When we help motherfuckers that actually wanted to get help, right? But then they get mad. We call y'all out when you don't want to get help, right? You no, know, he actually wanted help. That's why we actually helped him. That's why we actually helped him. But no, I know we got ten minutes, guys. We got ten minutes. Hold on. I mean, I'm going to turn this down, dog. I'm sorry, but yeah. But anyway, as we we're saying, dog, he actually wanted help. The fact that he wanted help, then uh, then that's how he got his help. We were actually helping him. Then from what we just told him. Now he can have make a choice. He can mm -hmm. either learn from myself or Lucario or mm -hmm. he can get therapy. But now he has more of a palette to see what he wants to do. Okay. Right. So what would you say you, Lucario, on that? Real shit. I mean, well, see, that's the this is the thing. It's like uh, you know, like <laughs> it's funny how, like you said, when we're at where we're a guy is like, listen, I'm gonna be honest and let you know what it is, and we're we're letting him know what it is, then it's an issue. You see, because a lot of times what happens is, is guys, we thinking that we up here trying to make fun of somebody, right? Mm -hmm. oh, what we're doing is we're showing guys what it is through 
expressing what the game is to them so they understand where they're going wrong, right? So y'all will come in here and then try to mimic that and, and think that you're doing what we're doing and you're not doing that. You see what I'm saying? That's that's what we're trying to get, get at. All right, absolutely. And the, and the problem with most of y'all guys out here is that you got to get a, there has to be a break from the effeminate and the emotional. Mm. Uh, and it has to be a break. It's the toughest break, but it has to be a break. Mm -hmm. And if you cannot handle the kindness that we're giving you, because compared to what a woman's going to do to your bitch ass, this is kind. Right. This is this is nice. Mm -hmm. you know, compared to all the shit a woman can do to you, all, all the shit getting you financially, mentally, emotionally, using you, abusing you, running you, wasting your time. This is kind, this is kindness. Right. And if you think we're mean, wait till you get in front of a woman that realize you got a tight pussy. Wait, mm -hmm. what what happens? Mm -hmm. That's a fact. That's a fact. So, guys, we got five minutes left. Call in. Uh, five uh, minutes left. Call in. We got y'all. 859 8744 is the number. So, call in. Or if you have a question, put a cue in the chat. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all yeah. just got to understand. Y'all create this. I keep telling you, women don't use you. You train women to use you. Women mm -hmm. don't dog you out. You dog yourself out by you saying, I ain't shit to myself, so dog me out. I ain't got no standards, so walk all over me. So right. how do you how do y'all blame women for when y'all motherfuckers y'all motherfuckers ain't even got a standard? Mm -hmm. And yet y'all think women are bad. You guys train every woman to do what the fuck they're doing to you. Women just don't wake up in the morning and say, you know what? I, I, I'm gonna use uh, I'm gonna use you, Dex. Women, a woman wake up. You know what? I, I, I'm gonna treat when, when, when Dex at, at five o'clock on the corner of uh your my 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 dick on your forehead, and my balls in your mouth. I'm gonna run into Dex and I'm gonna just dog him out. <laughs> yeah, y'all y'all act like they got this itinerary already of meeting you. When I get to the club, the car at ten o'clock. Oh, and, and, and somebody rolls up on me. I'm just going to dog him out. No, right. they just say, I'm going to go out and have a good time. Mm. And then as soon as they see you coming up, oh, God, I can already <laughs> tell this weird motherfucker. What? I'm sorry. I'm not interested. No, no, thank you. I'm not interested. And then they, all you did, all y'all call them bitches and shit. Right. <laughs> and whining and complaining. Whining and complaining. And a chick don't want to talk to you. It's crazy, man. It's it's terrible out here, man. Exactly, exactly, man. So, guys, got a few more minutes. Got a question? Oh, uh, let me. Oh, god damn it! Why? You know what? You know. You, let me tell you something, Dan. Let me tell you something funny. Let me tell you something funny, Dan. Do you understand? It takes you about ten or fifteen minutes to make a new picture or a new uh, thing. It takes you about ten or fifteen minutes. But you know, it just takes me one second to block you. Right, so you, you went that? All that to come back you went on. All that to come back in for one second to be blocked. It's amazing. And, it's a, and then you gonna go. You got look. You got to go get a Google account. <laughs> you got to go make sure the number works. Then you got to set up a YouTube account. Then you got to go back in your Google and prove that. And then you got to so God. And then you got to find us to subscribe to us to jump on. To, that that's time. That's time. That's time. <laughs> But you know he ain't doing shit in his life. That's terrible, ain't man. Ain't doing shit like that other dumb motherfucker. Ain't doing shit in his life, but that's sitting around crazy. being a dumb fuck. That's sad, man. That's sad. That, 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 I, listen, man, I wish I had that type of time on my hands. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I know, for real. I, I, wait, I wish there was that kind of time in the world, but there is that, that, there's not that time in the world. Right. And that's what we say to y'all guys. It's just not no time in the world. And that's why y'all will continue to lose because y'all continue to do sucker-ass shit. And mm -hmm. I give and Russell, hey, Russell, my hat's off to you, brother. Russell, we're proud of you, Russell. We we both are proud of you. You did a great, you did a great job, buddy. And 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 I know it might not seem much, but yeah, you just have to decide off of what we talked about to both of us to you to decide mm -hmm. if you need if you want to get a coach or therapy. But you're definitely gonna need one thing because there's mm -hmm. a lot of pent-up issues in you that are hurting you out in the world. And we do appreciate actually somebody that is actually asking questions for themselves. A car would say you before right. we roll. That's a fact. And that's, that's what we, that's what we telling you guys, man, just be real with your shit. 
so that you can actually get real results. You see, that's that's all it is. Step outside the ego and yes. see real results, and you'll be all right. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Absolutely. Good job, Russ. We're proud of you, brother. Great yeah. job, man. Uh, we love the honesty, and it would it took a lot. It takes a lot of courage to say what you said, man. Very, very takes a lot, man. And we're proud of you. Okay, see that, guys. Y'all think I'm an asshole, but you know what? I keep it real when I see real. Russ, mm -hmm. you're a real one, brother. We're proud of you, man. All right, all right, guys. So we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna go ahead and roll, man. We appreciate you guys. We'll see y'all next Tuesday. We out.